but she's still not saying anything. So that's when I decided to put her to the test because I knew something was up when I was at Your work or doing edge. something. Like for part three, I'm out of time. Nah, man, fuck you man, in part three. Man, give a fuck what you going through. <laughs> <laughs> fucking what the fuck? bullshit. Nah, bro, he, he didn't get my, he didn't get my <laughs> interest, bro. Fuck what you going through. <laughs> Welcome back to another episode of Cheaters. Apparently... Dex likes pulling up cheaters. This nigga always likes saying I like something, bro. <laughs> you you should have heard this guy behind the camera a couple minutes ago. Bro, we need hot stuff. We, we, got, we got to get crazy. We need to be here yelling, going wild. I'm no, like, all right, let me go some, let me go some no, crazy. Oh, this guy, he can't get enough of this cheating. This, this nigga incest, lost the privilege bro. to this say, motherfucker, he I say wild. he like it. This nigga went in one of our comments on uh, on Instagram <laughs> from one of our accounts and was like, <laughs> he was like, hey guys, it's me, word. Totally not Dex pretending to be word. And then said, I love Ice Spice. In quotes. Yeah, man. You know, at least it reads as fictitious. Does it, bro? Oh, these motherfuckers <laughs> do stupid sometimes, man. So today we're going to be watching something about some cheaters. Yeah, this guy caught his girlfriend cheating in a hot tub or something. A hot tub. In a hot topic. It's a weird place to cheat. Back shots in the back of hot topic. Nothing weird about that, bro. But like the adrenaline. All them bro. sex toys on the wall. It's the perfect place if you ask me. <laughs> it's it's, easy it's access, the Hunger bro. Games of public sex. Exactly. Hey, I'm gonna go hang out with the boys. Do you wanna come with? Hey, I'm gonna go hang out with the boys right now. Told it twice. Right, so this already feels Michael's fake. been acting super weird, super twice. weird every time. That honestly out, makes it read more phone, real to me. Him. Like, uh, like he said it and she didn't really care, and he wasn't ready. So then he had to go upstairs and get ready, and then he came back down and felt like he should say it again. And but I, I mean, I'll, I'll have more of an opinion as it as it unfolds. As we progress, people. I don't know who it is, so I'm gonna hide out. I'm not actually going to hang out with my boys. I'm gonna hide out. And I'm gonna catch her. Yeah, just Watch screaming this. in your fucking living room while she's right oh, outside. This nigga got a blue lives matter flag on his ceiling. What are you hiding upstairs? Right? He like to look at that shit when he sleeps. That is a wild place. placement for a flag, bro. No matter what you rep in, bro, above your bed is an insane placement. Bro, I mean, not if you jerk off to it every night before you go to bed. Then you turn perfect. that blue line white. You <laughs> color it in, bro. Gotta aim it. <laughs> Gross. Yeah, you started it. <laughs> Oh, this is totally fake. What is this, bro? Who the fuck is Damn. that? Damn! Yo, that motherfucker came ready! Yo! <laughs> bro, even if this is real, why would this motherfucker was naked and in the tub, basically? Yeah, in the two seconds after he left. As soon as he got through the door. Bro, they have time to sprint down the stairs. Bro, he came here for some ass. And he gonna get it. Exactly. He don't give a fuck that this nigga came home, bro. He don't give a fuck if it's the nigga's yeah, ass oh, he so gets. you just watching or you filming it? Yeah, either way, this is happening. Or she filming and we doing it. What's going on? So I'm getting Just cheap. let me know. I drove 45 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> but... I caught her red-handed, basically, right? And so everyone's asking, how did you catch her? What led to that point? And she's always texting someone, so I'm like, this is weird, and she's not telling me who she's texting, so I'm like, whatever, brushing it off. One night, I came home from work, and she was acting a little bit off when we were making dinner. She was overly happy and everything, and I was just like, all right, maybe she's in a good mood, but then again, I was like, this is kind of weird. And someone- she, was, she thought she got away with cheating, but <laughs> Wow, she's in a good mood. Why, why does her lip kind of smell like my dick? Hey, Maybe she gave me top buddy. earlier. <laughs> yeah. Maybe she gave me top earlier. <laughs> that's that coat, bro. No, that shit's real, bro. That's that cuck, nigga. <laughs> that's... Oh, nah, shit. Bro. It's cuck light. Diet cuck. Diet cuck. But she's still not saying anything. So that's when I decided to put her to the test because I knew something was up when I was at Your work or doing edge. something. Like for part three, I'm out of time. Nah, man, fuck you man, in part three. Man, give a fuck what you going through. <laughs> <laughs> what the this bullshit. Nah, bro, he, he didn't get my, he didn't get my interest, bro. Fuck what you going through. <laughs> bro, imagine that at the police station. I think I'm in there panting, covered in sweat and blood. Help me, help me, my whole house is... Man, I don't care what you going through. <laughs>
I don't think that was real at all, but we got another roll of the dice. I think this one's real, or I hope, because apparently she did a fall a follow up after the fact. Okay. So we'll we'll be able to verify. Is this the same channel? No, this is a different person. Oh. All right, man. So, look, I don't know the story, but either way, this is a really weird way to behave around humans. It's weird as fuck. Look, I don't know. Maybe you got cheated on, but uh, sitting here faking emotions and fake crying and making faces when he's not looking is really not a good look. Yeah, you look bro, mad I don't know. You weird. can do so much to a cheater. Uh, Seriously. I don't, like, I don't even like when, like, they, they start damaging property, but yeah. that is more respectable <clears throat> to me because then you're at least outwardly like, fuck you. You're like, fuck you behind his back and posing like it's painful. You don't think that's weird? You kind of look like the, the lady from Gone Girl right now. Like, this just, is some real manipulative shit. Realistically speaking, bro, like, you're, you're playing yourself. Like, why are you even wasting your time? Yeah, you I don't understand yourself. what she's gaining out of feigning what, pain. That he feels bad? Or, I don't know, bro. You know, I guess what she's saying is she's cheating on him. So she caught him cheating. She don't really care, but now she's going to see what she could get out of it. I was it. hoping like, that just, wasn't the case. Still seem... If it is, you're, all, you're even more of a piece of shit. <laughs> like, you're even sitting here faking sad if you're cheating on him and he cheated. Y'all should both just be honest. Y'all either need an open relationship or to both just fuck off. But I think she responded. I think there's more. Just so that I know what you've been doing behind my back, and that's all I have to say to you today. So I really hope it was worth it all. Really. Today's the last day. I need my key. Okay, so in the caption, she says, this was the first ex I caught cheating. This is why my trauma was so bad in that last video. The same thing happened a year later after healing. So she got cheated on again. That's unfortunate. Uh, so you're, you're, I mean, I, I'm not saying that they don't deserve to feel bad, but like, why are you then going to be manipulative? Like something bad happened to you where someone was dishonest and now you're going to go on to be dishonest and manipulative? I don't know, bro. I mean, call it a defense mechanism, I guess. But I like, call it a shitty person, personally. But I'd rather you laugh in his not. face. No, like, seriously. It's a, I don't know, bro. Don't know, just, something rubs me the wrong way about you, like, acting, like, pretending. Yeah, you know I, mean? I look at the situation objectively. You read like the villain now. Whatever happened to you before, you're at the point now where decisions read like the bad guy. And maybe you don't want to do that. I need my battery, please. Well, I have nowhere to go, so. It's not my problem. I'm oh, sorry. what the fuck? Bro, you can't cheat on people, and that's the first thing you say. Wow. That can't be the first thing you say. <laughs> With some no, gall, bro, too. Sorry, bro. Bruh, bruh said, well, <laughs> yeah, I got nowhere to go, yeah, no, so. He said, like, he put her in checkmate. Like, well, you know, <laughs> I'm not leaving, so. Like, you make so, it, like, that's not a fucking you problem, no, bro. Dad, you lost all privileges when you started cheating. This guy, I see why you were traumatized. This guy is a piece of shit. But one thing that I try to live by personally, when there's bad people in your life and they have a bad effect on you, you could go on letting that control your decisions, but then you're spreading that effect onto others. Or you could look back and be like, I didn't like them, I don't wanna be like them, and you could stop that energy from getting spread any further. You could leave them and leave all of that kind of energy behind you. But don't become a different person based off of how they treated you then they kind of win in a way, don't they? Like, yeah. you gonna change because of somebody's actions that you don't respect? It's not the best. Sounds way. like you letting lame people influence you. Yeah. And, you know. And this guy is corny talking about, I got nowhere to go. I <laughs> got nowhere to go. This, this nigga is crazy. Fucking shit mom don't even want to hear from him. That's how <laughs> fucked Facts. up. Facts. Don't you remember I fucked my mom's boyfriend? I can't go back <laughs> there. I can't there. go back there. <laughs> I'm at least taking the count. He does sound like this kind of person, bro. He gonna put a line of tape down in the in the room and be <laughs> this like. This is my side. <laughs> this is <laughs> your side. <laughs> that nigga repaint the walls only past the line. Oh, it's my side. Yeah, I can do what I want. He knocked down a wall. This nigga is a. a you gotta beat him to death after that. Sweet life and Zach and Cody. Yeah, that's why I couldn't be on any of those shows. You heard what I? What my solution was just <laughs> <You> now. <gotta laughs> not baby. So. It's not my problem. I'm sorry. I just couldn't. You don't have any idea what you might have done. I feel like I'm 
feel like you already acknowledged it by saying he needs somewhere to stay. Like he, you have an idea, right? What have you done? Like this, it's real. I mean, you kept bringing up Snapchat this morning, so I'm only assuming it has to do with Snapchat. Not answer. Hey yo, why the fuck he talking like that? You just some fucking assuming she has Snapchat. He fucking. talk like his shoulders always raised and his head to the side. <laughs> he sound like he, he always Snapchat. denying everything. Always, <laughs> but he talk like Boomhauer from King of the Hill. <laughs> Boomhauer. That's what this nigga talking like, bro. Go back. Yeah, that was spot on. We're right behind there. Bro, oh, just have some. You know she's on the app you cheated on. You can't just be like, yeah, I did this. I, Why are we still playing these fucking games? I think what's happening is she doesn't really know what he did. And she's, and she's just, trying to coax it out of yeah, him. Yeah, but he's stupid. And even if, bro, like, you heard him, bro. He don't got nowhere to go, Yeah. He, no, I'm like, he, he already know he caught. Like, it's so weird that he's then going to turn around and not say what happened. Like, I need somewhere to sleep, but did I even do anything wrong? <laughs> did I? But don't kick me out. <laughs> but I did got, I? I got nowhere to go. <laughs> Snapchat. What might be on it? What might be on there? I guess it's. Take your stuff and If you thought for a second I was going to reply to you today, you've got me fucked sideways. Look, hey, good for you for standing up for yourself, but maybe you need some practice on, on coming at people, bro. Not a chance in hell. It's okay. You can, can let your mom know that you did this, that you cheated he on me. He told him to go to his mama house. <laughs> <laughs> I can't go this over there. This nigga calling her up? You, bro, what is this? This is that ass reading like Chris Hansen. Oh, call your wife and tell her what you've done. I'm going to have some of your pizza. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna have some of your pizza. He don't gotta do shit, bro. She already kicking him out. He he's going home. That's why he called him. But he just need that point. He just need a crumb of house, bro. He just need a crumb of house. Just let me stay here a few hours. I don't want to have to walk. At least let me order Greyhound. Hello. Good morning. Oh, and her friends. Oh, so her friends came over and she's talking about it after the fact. What the shit? You, you said you had him sucking your dick. Hey, describe it how you want. Odd choice of words. I'm not gonna lie. on camera. What you lying? For? Yeah, it didn't go down quite like that. Did he basically be like, "Please, I got nowhere to go." Yeah, and he sucked, bro. But don't gas it like that either. But you know, I mean, good for her though. Like, yeah, she, you know, she's probably going through a lot of emotions right now. It was probably very cathartic for her. Yeah, Let me get off your dick. I'm glad you, I'm glad you yeah. own this loser. I'm fucking good. Yeah, like I'm fucking crawling. He's fucking crying. He's fucking shaking. He goes, I guess, crying. I guess it's about Snapchat. It's probably about all the nudes, right? Oh, you fucking dumb fuck. No. Could it be that? <laughs> Could it be the nudes? I said, you're going to tell your mom. You're going to let her know right now. So you there you go. Shit. Brag about that. He yeah. really, he really yeah. did that. Yeah, that's true. He really made that nigga <laughs> call his mom. You should have led with that, honestly. That part is crazy. Hey, bro. Good for you. You got yeah. it. I don't know what happened with that next guy. It's uh, from what the caption said. It seems like you were cheating on him, and then he cheated on you, and then you were faking feelings behind his back. Really weird. This, yeah. what we just watched, is not a good excuse for you to go around acting like that. If you out here cheating on people, you're the, you're the same piece of shit that guy yeah, was, you, unfortunately. You, you just became the thing that you were like, that hurt you hard enough to become the thing. Exactly. So you, by, by accepting their lifestyle as yours, you then kind of give the okay that they did that to you. By your logic, all he got to do is pull up a video and be like, my first girlfriend cheated on me. And yeah. now he's completely vindicated and all the bullshit he did to you, yep. sitting there moping around calling his mama. Yeah, unless you're willing to admit you're a piece of shit too. Fair enough. IDFG, IDFK, IDFL, Elemental P, all the channels. Go subscribe, find them. There's too many things, too many places to click and support. I'm word, mind of Dex. It's true, bro. Trippy Go to Patreon. Rounds. There's more shit. You can watch a 35 minute version of this video. 30 minutes, my bad, on Patreon. If you can't get enough of us, you want those dirty jokes, those mean little jobs, us giving handies under the table. Whoa. All the good shit, man. It's all on there on Patreon. It's not going to help all the gay jokes. One dollar a month, man. You could, you could get up access to all our gay porn.
<laughs> yeah, man. You know, you know the YouTube stuff. We'll catch you guys later.